Hi all, welcome back to another video. Today, let's see how to convert a lead to an opportunity. So, in CRM, opportunity management is like a key to success. We can create an opportunity once we start a sale deal discussion with a customer. The stage changes when our discussion progresses and we can say we have won the opportunity when the customer engages in a deal with our firm. Now, let's see how we'll convert a lead to an opportunity. For that, let's open the CRM module. Now, inside the CRM module, you have the configuration settings. Go to the configuration settings and here you can see leads. The thing is that you have to enable it. Saving it. Okay, so when you enable it, a menu will come which is the leads. Here you can see leads. So from there, you can directly access the existing leads. So if you want to create a lead, you can do that from here as well. So I'm clicking the leads menu here. Now here you can see all the leads. Okay, if you want, you can click on generate leads. You can also create it from here. So currently, let's open any of these leads. So furniture for new location, I'm opening that lead. So here we have a lead. Now, if you see, you can see this is the name of the lead and here you have the probability. Okay, so it's given as 20. If you want, you can change it. And then we have the company name, address, the website, language, salesperson. If there's no salesperson, you can assign one. You can also assign a sales team. And here you can see add property from this button. You can just click and add a new field if you want. So I'm not doing anything. Okay, and here you have the contact name, email, job position of that particular contact name, their phone number, mobile, and here we have the priority. We can set priority for this particular lead. Okay, now I'm clicking on the convert to opportunity. So while clicking on that, a wizard pops up. And here they ask for conversion action. We have two types of action, which is convert to opportunity or merge with existing opportunity. You can choose from either one of them. So if I just click on this merge, conversion means it will automatically convert directly to an opportunity. Merge with an existing opportunity means it will be merged with an existing lead. So here you can see the lead. Now if I click on add a line, you can choose one lead from here. So this is furniture for new location. We'll choose office design, select. Okay, so office design is selected here. And just click on the create opportunity. Okay, so you can see furniture for new location and inside that you can see office design project, right? Now let's just go back. And here we have my pipeline. Open that. Here you can see the office design project, right? Just click on that. So this is what you have created right now, right? So here you can see merge the lead opportunity furnitures for new location into this one. Okay. So you can see this is how you merge an opportunity or a lead with an existing lead. Okay, and, and then convert it to an opportunity. Now from here, if you want to convert it to a new quotation or a new rental, you can do that. Just click on new quotation. And then you can create a quotation on this. So we'll talk about that later. We have one more type, which is to create a direct opportunity. For that, I'm going to the leads. And from here, I'm choosing the furniture and all has gone from here. So I'll choose office chairs. Okay, here you can see the probability percentage. Okay, and you have the company name, address, website and all. And here you have the internal notes. If you have any internal notes, you can give that. I'm giving details on chair. Okay, now under the extra info, you have the marketing details as well as the analysis. That is the assignment date and close date can be given here. So it will get automatically assigned actually. And here we have the company. You can choose a company from here. 
okay and from here you have the medium source and referred by that can be given here here we have the assigned part now okay and once you click on convert to opportunity that wizard comes again and here we are giving convert to opportunity itself here we have the option to assign the sales person and sales team and here you can see customer like create a new customer link to an existing customer or do not link to a customer so if you want you can create a new customer okay create a new customer on this name and if you want you can also link this to an existing customer and if you want do not link to a customer so i'll show you how to link this to a customer so i've clicked link to a customer and here i'm choosing azure interior okay so office chairs is the lead and i'm converting that to opportunity i'm linking that to an existing customer and the customer is azure interior now i'm creating the opportunity okay let's go to sales open my pipeline so here we have office chairs and here you can see the customer name which is azure interior okay so this has been linked to an existing customer see so this is how you link this to a customer while converting directly to a opportunity okay now this is an opportunity let's see what all actions we can perform on an opportunity okay so here we have the internal nodes which we have given while converting and here we have the extra information section here we have the company details the contact details that is the details of the customer to whom we have linked it okay and here we have the marketing details and the tracking details and here we have the assigned partners if any they will be shown here you have the priority assigned to this particular lead so you have three stars one is very high high and medium okay now if you just want to convert this to a quotation now this is in the qualified state okay you can just change the state by you know dragging and dropping you all know that okay so if you just open the office chairs here you can see the stage has changed to proposition okay now similar leads rentals quotation meetings and all can be seen there are two similar leads to this opportunity now if you create any quotation you will see there also so i'm creating a new quotation okay so there's a credit limit okay so uh, i'll do one thing we'll open some other leads i mean opportunity so i'm opening it new quotation so that this is not actually linked to a customer so i'm linking to an existing customer or we'll create a new customer and confirm so here we have the customer this is the quotation form right here you can add the product i'm adding acoustic block screens so the quantity also can be set from here okay now i'm confirming it to a sale order now this is a sale order okay and you can create the invoice do the payment and all that's the normal steps of a sale order like uh, of creating a sale order confirming it creating the invoice doing the payment confirming the delivery and all so here we have one lost enrich and all so what is one when it's in the one state you can just mark it and that ribbon comes here okay now if it's lost just click on lost so this will be marked as lost so before that you have to specify a reason it can be too expensive people don't have skills and not enough stock and all we'll give something and submit only then it will be marked as lost okay you have to specify a lost reason also now if you want to see the one and lost things you just go here click on the filter you have lost you can see the lost opportunities and if you want to see the one opportunities click on one here okay so this is how you create a lead create an opportunity through converting a lead and you have seen how to merge 
with a new customer how to link with an existing opportunity and all so that's all for today's video i hope it was helpful thank you